Hi everyone, welcome to part 4 of how to create a responsive web design in Figma. I think we are almost done and we have only few things left. Let's get into that quickly. Okay, in the last part, let's start with the designs. Let's see designs. So, how do we design? Last time, we images ready to collect the images. So, now we can convert the design. Full wireframe. Let's start with that. First, now and uh, as usual, now so our typography um, colors we have choose panni vechito already. Not colors exactly, primary color um, other colors, black, white, major colors we have style guide la add panni vechito. So now I'm gonna, if you haven't watched it that yet, you can go back to my uh, previous videos and then watch the previous parts and come to this so that you can understand better. Now, panna panna pora na. In the text, select panni, I'm going to convert them into or uh, change them into uh, Satoshi. We already select panni, which in the uh, typographic. So let me go with this. I'm trying to select all the text that I have. Okay, now everything is changed. I'm gonna change the colors based on it.
so now we have completed the design let's have a look this is so nice this is how we can design a classy simple and clean designs so we haven't grouped it Yes, now the design is complete. Thank you so much for watching. I'll meet you all in the last part tomorrow of this series. So yeah, let's rock. Bye-bye.